Well, hello again, Internet. Sean here, Mahalo.com. By the looks of it, you'd like to learn more about the RAM on your motherboard. Well, let's check it out. So the RAM on your motherboard, and RAM simply stands for Random Access Memory, and the RAM on your motherboard is simply used for that in-between data. So it's not hard storage like your hard drive. It's kind of a in-between data. And the metaphor I used previously was if your computer was a desk, then the hard drive would be your file cabinets where you could store items, and then the RAM would be the top of your desk. And this just means if you had a little bit of desk space to work with, you could only have maybe a few things on your desk at a time. But if you had a large desk, you could put a lot of things on that desk all at once. So essentially, you can run a lot of applications and programs with lots of RAM. If you don't have lots of RAM, you can really do one thing at a time. Now, when talking about RAM, a older style processor, a 32-bit processor, you can only have four gigs of RAM max. So if you're trying to max out an old system, just remember, 32-bit processor, four gigs of RAM. Now for the newer style, a 64-bit processor, you can have 16 gigs of RAM, which is quite a bit. Now, how this RAM connects is simply these two guys, at these two clamps right here. Boom, boom, and I see I'm grabbing it by the edge. Because RAM is one of the most, I say your RAM and your processor, are the ones that can be damaged the most from being shocked. Now, one thing to note is this little hook right here, this guy, it can only be inserted in one way because if you flip it around the other way, it won't lock in there. So that's one way that helps for RAM not getting mixed up. And again, to insert it, we'll just one side, one side, then the other side. And then once you have it seated, just kind of sitting there, click one, click the other. There you go. Now, another thing too, RAM is really easy to upgrade on your computer because simply click in a new chip. It's bigger, faster, well, bigger, double check your motherboard to see if you can allow it to be faster. And it's one of the easiest ways to speed up your computer. One other thing too about your RAM. If you're using one stick of RAM, you'll want to go closest to the processor because that'll be the default, the uh, primary stick. All right, now remember, just click on one of the items on the motherboard to learn more information about that item. And like always, guys, if you have a request from me, just send it on over to requests at mahalo.com.